Good morning, everybody. Hope everybody's having a phenomenal day. Headed to the gym bright and early. Car gonna pull right out in front of me. And this is exactly why uh, insurance down here is ridiculous. But uh, today is back and shoulder day. I did do cardio yesterday. I just didn't bring it to you, so I, I didn't record it. So some of you guys can be like, oh, well, if it's not recorded, it didn't happen. Well, I know deep down that the cardio got done. So anyway, moving on. So shoulders, um, back today. I have been trying to focus on a lot of uh, heavier weight on the back um, because I'm I'm probably gonna start implementing um, let's see pull-ups and chin-ups especially chin-ups for arm day and then uh, pull-ups for back day on the alternative back day um, I just kind of want to get because a pull-up is such a a good movement like I can get three right now non-assisted so um, I'm just getting to a point and I do love the feeling of a good lap pull down um, so I'm trying to go heavier on the back and then I'm actually moved up uh, a little bit for, for on the shoulders as well so that progressive overload is there I'm moving the weight up also trying to do like if, if, the, if the weights um, right on the edge of moving up I'll try to do you know keep the same weight but increase the reps a little bit because that'll still be decent progressive over, uh, overload there as well so anyway headed to the gym that's my thoughts for today and uh, we will definitely definitely have a good time in the gym so Hope you guys have a phenomenal uh, day. Hope you guys had a phenomenal Memorial Day yesterday. And uh, hope you said your thank yous and, and, and all that good stuff. So hope you have a phenomenal week and we'll see you during the workout. go back shoulders done I'm telling you man I went super heavy on the uh, on lap pull downs with the cable and my 
uh, row. Um, the row, I probably went too heavy, to be fair. But, you know, I still got the reps in. I, that was, pro like, I know that I'm getting stronger. I, I, I can feel my glasses about to go flying, but I can feel it. I can see it in the weight that's going up and up and up. So, um, definitely, um, and I changed the assisted pull-ups that I was doing. I actually um, am getting, you know, less and less on that. So I want to get to where I can legitimately unassisted pull-ups do 10 to 20, um, you know, without stopping. And then, you know, probably three sets. So, you know, as long as I can get like, well, actually, I want to, I, I wouldn't mind starting off with eight, to be fair. I mean, eight's a good number. Right now, I'm at three unassisted pull ups. I don't know how many chin ups I'm at. They don't, I didn't see a true chin up bar there. Well, yeah, actually, there is one on the other side, but um, yeah, so. I don't know. We'll definitely see. I, uh, you know, I don't think I've ever been able to do a pull up. Um, I'm not trying to clown myself. I'm not trying to troll or, or anything like that. I honestly, I, I don't, I don't think I've ever been able to do a pull up now that I'm thinking of thinking back. I don't know, but I'm doing three now. So that's all that matters. I'm doing three, but I want to get up to eight to 10 just so I can start implementing those. Cause I mean, I'm implementing the, uh, the assisted right now and they are such a great back workout. But uh, anyway, I'm at this point, I'm just rambling. So hope you guys have a phenomenal day. I'm going to hit up cardio here in a little while. You guys have a great day. Have a great workout. And we'll see you tomorrow for legs.